Hello everyone, it's been a long time since I've filmed. Okay, anyway, um, it's been probably like a week since I filmed and Sarah and I have gotten a lot done in our apartment. So this is going to be like a part two or three um, into us decorating because I feel like we're getting into a really good place but there's like the finishing touches that are coming together now that are really making it feel like home. So right now I am framing some pictures. I went to Michael's yesterday and bought a bunch of picture frames. I actually had to order some online also because they didn't have enough in stock for what I wanted. Um, but I'm going to do three picture frames on this wall um, of Sarah's proposal, my proposal, and then a wedding photo. And I don't have a frame for the wedding photo yet that's printed over there. And I just did those in black and white because they were all like different colors and I wanted them to just like be cohesive. Also, all of my pillowcases came in, so I'm obsessed. This throw blanket's not gonna stay there, it's just what's there now, but I'm obsessed with how they look. They all look so cute together. Paisley has been laying on each one, um, and they're so, they look so good. When this room isn't a mess, they all really go together, and they've come together so well. And I haven't shown our new coffee table. This is from West Elm. I've been staring at it for so long, and Sarah and I were like, fuck it, let's just buy it. There's storage inside, so all of our throw blankets are inside. Um, and it just looks so good. It matches everything so well. Um, and then also our bar stools are here. So I'm going to put those together once I'm done putting these things in frames and we'll see how they look. Okay, we're gonna build the stool. I just finished building the stools. They look so good. Let me show you guys. So they're a little bit darker wood than I thought, but I still think they look really pretty. So we needed ones that were like super specific heights and widths. This is like supposed to fit three, but they have to be really thin. So these were the really the only ones we could find that looked kind of how we wanted and also fit within that thinness so that we could get three stools in here. So that's that. Oh, also this is, I think my my Thanksgiving, I mean my Thanksgiving, what the fuck? My fall thing, I don't know. I'm tired, oh my God. Our nightstands just arrived. They're also Nathan James. These are like the viral nightstands. Literally everybody has them, but I just kept looking at them and going back to them because they just went with everything that we had or like the vibe that I'm trying to go for in our bedroom, which is, this is still how it looks. Um, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna build those really quickly. Okay, we just ate, but Sarah hung, what? Sarah. Hung our, we needed shelves for our skincare because we had them in this drawer. It was just like a drawer and they, I need them like standing up and facing me so I know what they are. But I just feel like, you know, here's the, here's the bathroom now. And I just feel like it looks cute. It's, it's, it does what it needs to do. And then, oh, I forgot to show you guys this. Um, I built this last week. And then the inside is more storage, um, tampons, and then that's the bathroom. The Sulis are relaxing. <laughs> okay, Sarah and I, it just looks so bad because our room is just like shit right now but our nightstands are obviously finished. Um, I'm gonna unpack my nightstand box and get it settled in here so that I'm not living out of box anymore. Good morning, everyone. Um, please excuse how I look. I got home from the gym and the morning has just escaped me. Um, so Sarah and I had our friend come over. Um, she like does house flipping and shit, so we trust her with a drill. She took down our old blinds, hung our curtain rod. I need to hang the curtains and then screw on the ends and I'll show that. And then she hung these for us. So we're still missing the third one, which will be our wedding photo. So it was my proposal, Sarah's proposal, and then our wedding photo will go down here. And it looks so good, I love it. And so I just went to Target to pick up with the blinds I ordered and I saw this blanket and I was like, you know what? It looks so cute. I thought, I didn't know if I would like the patterns mixed, but from over here, I feel like it looks so cozy and cute.
Okay, so as you can just see, I hung the curtains. It made such a difference. They look so good. This tree has to go back in that corner and hopefully it all just stays beautiful. Hello everyone, good morning. It is Thursday. Got some more in the mail. So I figured I would open it with you guys. So I got the really basic architectural digest, 100 of the century of style. I also had to order new AirPod Pros because I didn't realize this, but lost mine in the move. And then this is just Sarah ordered these because a shelf, we lost a peg on a shelf in a cabinet and we need to repair it. So, okay. So I think I want it. Do we like the remotes in the bowl better? Unsure. This is what it looks like from this angle. Okay, another update that I can share with you guys is that um, we're cleaning up out here. So our landlord just has to come get her like jacuzzi and stuff and all of this. And then today, Sarah and I ran to her parents' house um, and we took the big, our old TV stand and stored it in their house just because here we just don't have the space for it. So all this stuff was in it. I need to take this stuff and find a place to put it until we get like a dresser. Anyway, okay, so that's really all of the updates that I have for today. There's really nothing to share with you guys until my furniture comes, so this might pause until until then. More things just delivered, so I'm gonna show you. So I already know what these are. Um, so we obviously have the frames that I showed you hung on our wall. I got these five by five ones, and these are what I think I'm gonna put on this wall, a gallery of those. Um, eight by eight, which is what's on the wall with our engagements. This is where our wedding photo will go in. Okay, and then the, the next thing that I got are all the same. They are three Euro pillows that I got from Target for our bed in our room. They're a little rinky, but I just wanted like big linen looking ones that were like neutral. Um, so yeah, they might need a different insert, I think, but this is like the exact color I wanted and they were cheaper than a lot that I saw online. So I got three of these. The last thing that I got, I actually already own, but I own it in small, but I feel like I would like the medium better. This set from Amazon, it's just like the pants and then this shirt. And that is it for right now. Hello everyone! I have not been on in a while, but I'm on today because I'm gonna take you guys through like my, obviously my like decorating process and our dresser came. So I think I'm gonna build it. I ordered a rug for in here. It comes hopefully next week. And then I feel like you guys have seen basically everything else. Look how dreamy the living room looks right now with the sunlight coming through. Well, I'm gonna focus, there we go. Oh, I also got Paisley this cute bed today. I'm hoping I can get rid of this one if she likes this one enough. Anyway, all right, I'm gonna build this dresser and We'll see how it goes. Hello, everybody. It is the day after we received the dresser. Actually, no, it's just the day after we built it. Um, my camera died last night, so I had to charge it this morning. Dresser's done. This is not how this is gonna stay. I just needed to move it from over here, but dresser's done. It's beautiful. Rug just arrived, super excited. So I'm gonna get this rolled out so we can see it. So it's gonna go like this underneath our bed, but obviously our bed frame's not here yet. So I'm gonna see what I can do. I don't. You gotta go. Go in the living room. Just trying to lay on the bed while I do everything. I'm so out of breath from that. <laughs> but I actually really like the way it looks. Um, it's obviously super neutral, but I feel like it brings a good texture into the room. I have done that to our vacuum like 80 times. Sarah's gonna fucking kill me. Guys, hello. I haven't spoken to you in quite a few days. Today is, I don't even know. October 23rd, gone for the weekend. We were upstate and we left at like, we woke up at like 4.30, left at five. And I'm so tired. I want to nap so bad. I literally need to fall asleep. But to fight napping, I decided to organize our bedroom closet so that I didn't nap because I would rather just go to sleep tonight. So, going to catch you up on what we're doing. I listed all of these frames on Marketplace. They're basically like all of the prints and frames we've had in our last like four apartments. 
Um, I'm over them. I don't want them anymore. I don't like the vibe. I had them for a long time. I had them literally for like four or five years. So I listed them for free. I said, the only catch is you have to take every single one. And that was the last box we had in our apartment. So our hamper will go in here. I need to reorganize the closet. And then all of here was just like wasted space. So I'm trying to organize that for now. So this is what it looks like right now in the midst of reorganizing. I'm hoping someone responds to Marketplace like soon and snags these so that they're out of our way. I'll update you guys as I clear things out. I'm going to take some stuff downstairs into the basement and then I'm going to bring a bin up to store all this stuff in. So I'll be back. Hello, my friends. It's been another few days. Um, so I haven't been on since Monday and Monday was the day that I organized our closet. So that is done. It obviously does not look organized right now because I just ordered picture frames and I, I'm not putting them up until our bed frame comes. So those are down there, but I organized it. It may not look like it to you, but it's better than it was. And it's as good as it's gonna get until we have our bed frame because our bed frame has drawers built in on each side and then at the base. So once I know what that kind of storage is gonna look like for us, I will have a better idea of how I can organize the rest of our space. I don't think that I have showed you guys kind of the vibe of what our bed is looking like. So it's, it's super creamy. I'm gonna get some patterned pillows for here and then a long lumbar and then a short pattern lumbar here. And I think I'm gonna get darker ones to kind of make it like warm it up a little bit. But the reason that I picked up the vlog camera today is that I have a cabinet I ordered delivering today. And the cabinet is gonna go in the living room. It's actually going to go as long as it fits. Ideally, it will like perfectly fit here with us still being able to get outside. It's an arched cabinet. I'm fingers crossed because if not, it might have to go against this wall. So. It's literally beautiful, it's from Urban Outfitters. Here's kind of an overview of what our living room is looking like right now. It's so cozy and cute, I'm obsessed with it. We've obviously been hanging out in here today a bit, so it's not like perfectly organized, but it just looks so cute. I can't wait for this corner to be done. I don't even like looking in this corner because I just feel like this whole area just looks so plain. Okay, so the delivery driver just came but the drop off like didn't include stairs so they didn't bring it upstairs for me, which is fine. Like I completely understand. Um, so Sarah's on a meeting when she's done, she's gonna have to help me. This fucking thing is huge and the guy told me it weighs 250 pounds, so. Okay, here we go. It's very heavy and I'm not oh, risking it. Holy shit. We might have to open this. I can't do it. You want me to push? Wait, wait, I have an idea. Let's just push it up against the carpet. So Sarah and I can't get it up the steps. With the two of us, there's just no easy way for us to pick it up and carry it up. So it's she's taking pieces out. Large and heavy. These very nice people saw Sarah and I struggling to get this upstairs. It was terrible. Sarah and I literally could not figure out how to get it up. It was so heavy and long. Um, and they came, five men came and help, helped us and I, well, I don't know how we would have gotten it up here without them. They wouldn't let us give them money or anything. They were just so sweet. So now it's up. We're gonna get it filled in and see if we love it here and go from there. Okay, so Paisley thinks I'm about to feed her. I need to feed her. Um, so I put some decor that we already had just lying around like extra from the old apartment in. I need to fill these drawers. So this is the living room. From the kitchen um and this cabinet fills the wall great i feel like i still need something here i'll figure out what i want exactly i'm very happy with it i love this cabinet it is so stinking cute i can't wait to like really style it a little bit better okay everyone it's the next day Sarah and i are really quickly going to move the cabinet to the other wall to see if i like it better It's, I don't think so. I think it looks bad from over here. It's so and I just moved it back because I just like it better like this. Um, but we got our COVID and flu Woo! vaccines today and my fucking COVID vaccine hurts. I also dyed my hair darker, you guys can't tell. This is what a Halloween weekend looks like when you're in your 30s. <laughs> It is, tell them what time. 6.17. <laughs> and we will be asleep in less than two hours, probably. 
so okay i'm gonna end this vlog here um there is another one coming i'm basically like on track for weekly vlogs at this point because a the decorating in this apartment never ends and b christmas is next month so now we're gonna do our annual christmas decorating video so very excited to show you the apartment and to continue showing you guys how i decorate it and tune in next week for the next video